What it is, what it do, ladies and gents. Welcome back to the final part. Yes, to the final part of my Saints Row walkthrough. Welcome back. Or Saints Row 2022. Or Saints Row Remake. Nope, reboot. Not remake, reboot. I hate it when developers name stuff like that, that like do like a reboot of like a of like one of their older titles and just name it the same thing as their first one. It's like, God Jesus. SEO on YouTube is such a pain in the butt with that crap. But it's called God of War. It'd be God of War 4 or God of War 2018? Like, I get it. I get it. But, you know. Anyways, let's get cracking. But first, ladies and gents, thank you all for the love and support on this walkthrough thus far. Much love. And hello to all new viewers. I see you over there. Chilling like a villain. Alright, let's do this. Things could get out of hand at the Saints party. Are you ready for this, boss? Yes. Let's do this. Hey, where are you? Big party's getting started. We cannot kick it off without you. Crap. I lost track of time. On my way. I wouldn't miss it for the world. You sure you're at the right party? This is a celebration for the Saints. Is it not? We got a party going on, so I'm gonna keep this one short and sweet. Fuck the Panteros, fuck the idols, fuck Marshall. The Saints are here to stay, baby! We built this together. Thanks for getting shot, Eli. Should we go in? You guys go. I just wanna take a minute out here. Heard there's a party. <laughs> hey! It's good to see you, man. I've been thinking a lot about what you said. About the Saints. I've been alone for a long time. I always viewed friends as a liability. A weakness. But I was wrong. Seeing you with Kev, Nina, Eli... They really make you stronger. Yeah, they really do. I want to know what that feels like. <clears throat> well, let's go! <gasps> <laughs> Why? Well, because I cannot live your life if you are still breathing. <laughs> you have a lot of heart, but let's face it, I'm just a, a better version of you. <laughs> You could not even protect yourself. How would you ever protect your friends if someone like me came along? Huh? This is for the best. Do not worry. I'll keep our friends safe. Oh man, I'm in the space between space. The lands between. Hey, Nina's car. Boy, it was a beaut. My family's so far away, you know. It feels like I'm keeping part of them with me. All our dreams are true. I don't know why that cactus right oh. over there looks like it's oh, giving me the middle that. finger. Eli's whiteboard. I feel like there's a lot we're missing. There is, but it's enough to go on for now. 
Try to keep up this time. We built this together. Waffle iron. Did we ever get that for Kev? I can't remember. Oh, thanks for the rescue. Really owe you one. Forget it, man. We're family. Dinner at a show, baby. To answer that question, no, you did not. I will remember. Your waffle what irons are it? way I too expensive remember. nowadays. I was supposed to do something. <laughs> You're right, I am late. I just can't remember for what. All oh, right, game night. Meet your friends at the bedding zoo. I'm here, guys. Sorry I'm late. No worries, we started without you. Hurry up if you want in. Man. This reminds me of that one scene in The Boys with uh, Black Noir in season three. Hopefully he comes back for season four. Hey, glad you made it. You've got some catching up to do, but you might still win if you collect three more bears. And I can help you with that. If you get me seven measly little llamas, I will give to you this extremely valuable bear. Seven to one? That's highway robbery. But I'm in. Here, llama llama. That's two llamas. That's three. Four. Uh, five llamas. So, six. Tick tock. Deck hot. I take delivery of seven llamas and present to you one bear. Thanks, man. My bear's gonna kick your llama's ass. Game ain't over. It's Nina's turn. Wait, why would I trade a bear for a llama? Like, come on now. <laughs> let's, let's not get too crazy here. Wait, what was that? to the party glad to be here how can i help you i've got almost a full collection of elephants but the baby ran away got a second bear for you if you can find it for me one baby elephant coming up snakes i didn't know we were playing with the snake expansion don't blame us you're the one who bought it okay Come here, elephant. Come on now. There we go. Have you ever actually petted an elephant? No, but it seems it would be really cool if we did. It's gonna take more than a hurt. Don't run. It's okay. Sloth, almost there. Lose a turn, but gain a heart. Hey, hey you guys. Elephant, come get your bear. Oh, Mira, get cute. Thank you. And here is your bear. Pleasure doing business with you. Okay, Kev, your turn. Why am I trading all the cool animals for a bear? Uh, no offense, bears, they're not that cool. They're like dinosaurs. Dinosaurs are not that cool. Dragons, really awesome. Hey, buddy. Hey, yourself. What can I do for you? I'm playing a snail strategy tonight. Find me three snails, and I will give you this bear I just happen to have in my hand. Last bear for the win. Okay. I wouldn't mind trading a snail Wait, for a bear. Where did all the snails go? They're hiding, but come on. You can outsmart snails, can't you?
One snail. Damn snakes. Hey, nobody made you buy the expansion. Two snails. Let's check this one. God damn it. Snakes keep getting in the way. What? They are coming from the barn. That's weird. Yeah, I should go in there and root them out. Forget about the stupid old barn. Stay here. I lay the top. Last for the win. I don't know. Snickerdoodle's right. I've gotta go in there and deal with the snakes. Hey, Snickerdoodle. Purgatory. My clothes. Is that my blood? <laughs> oh my god. The party. Kev, Nina, Eli. You should have listened to your friends. You should have known better than to play with snakes. Help me! Somebody help! Eli? I'm coming. Well, what happened to the whole honor among thieves, man? Hello? Uncharted 2 taught us that. <laughs> where are you? There's. Oh, God. I didn't even see that. If you'd been there at the idols party, I wouldn't have gotten shot. Eli. You let your friends get hurt because you were wallowing in your own self pity What kind of friend does that? The one that misses a lot like me. Good game, safe at home, but when it matters, you have your friends now. You do not have what it takes. When the real bad guys show up to play, you come up snake eyes. <laughs> Man, this is like a haunted kid's nightmare right here. shall prevail. Okay, all four dead. Anybody there? I'm here! Kevin, I'm here! Kev? I wasn't calling you. Don't you get it? You're just not a good enough friend. No. The way out through the Kingdom Hearts door. Oh, 
What? Why can't I move? Because you can't do anything right. You ruin everything. That's why you needed me. Now you're dead, and everything you built is mine. Your friends are mine, your empire is mine, the saints are all mine. Like hell they are! Nina? Kev? Eli? Anybody? You have three new messages. Hey, it's Kev. Where are you at? The crate paper's up, the music's pounding, the party's starting. Where did you go? Antonio's still waiting to talk to you. Dude's sitting here with a big briefcase of money. Let's not leave that on the table, huh? Where the fuck are you? The Nawali's gone crazy. He's shooting. Hi, Nina. You will not be needing your phone any longer. Oh, God. Oh, man. Are they about to kill off the cast right here? Everything smells amazing, Kev. Uh, you know what would make it smell even better? Let me guess. Pancakes. You know it. <laughs> Hey, look who's home. How was your day? <sighs> Not bad. I got some blood on my favorite shirt. <laughs> Sounds like you could use some champagne. Hmm. Thanks, Eli. Please, sit. So, what did you all do today? You know what we did. You're upset. You think? I do not like to see you upset. Well, maybe you should have thought of that before. Nina, please. We'll discuss your gratitude later. Hello. Where are they? They're safe. I am coming for you, motherfucker. Good. It'll save me some time. I'm sorry. That threw me off. Uh, okay. <clears throat> we'll try this again with a little more energy. And Kev, be sure to have some club soda ready, eh? I don't want this stain to set. Everything smells amazing, Kev. Guns. I need guns to rescue them. Yeah, okay. I know where to get those. What about my guns? But that's a really cool reveal that freaking witch, I'm gonna call it. Uh, they were on the, uh, on the stage. Sorry, that like threw me for a loop. I'm like, what the heck? Like, we live next to our graveyard since when? Come on, Kev. Pick up. Pick up. Yo, this is Kevin. My phone's on silent, so leave a message after I drop the beep. Wait for it. Wait for it. Kev, I don't know if you'll... when you'll get this, but... everything's going to be fine. I'm coming to get you, okay? I won't let you down. Hello. You've reached Eli's voicemail. I can't come to the phone right now, 
But if you'll leave a message, you can trust I'll get back to you within a reasonable time frame. Eli, it's me. You hang in there, okay? You're not gonna get hurt this time. I'm on my way. This is Nina, you know what to do. Hey, Nina, I'm coming. I'm gonna kill the bad guy this time. Happened to all the roads. Okay, I need guns. Lots of guns. I can't sound as good as Keanu Reeves. Granted, no one can. An alarm. Better arm up quick. That back, this back, this back, nope, this back, Fuckwad, guess where I am? In your house, taking your stuff! <laughs> I'm waiting for you. Let's finish this back where we began it. Ah! It all ends where it began, cliche. Oh. Finish this where we began it? That's definitely a trap. Fuck, I got no other leads. Guess I'm gonna walk into this trap. Next stop, Silver Gulch. Okay, gotta get psyched. Oh, I know. But only you can decide how you react to adversity. Only you can choose to adapt to the changes that life throws your way. Your friends deserve better. You deserve better. You are more than a cog in a corporate machine. You are not defined by your student debt or your useless degree. You have more agency and power than the world wants you to know. But to realize that power, there's something you need to do. You need to be your own boss of your job, of your happiness, of your life. You don't make $15 an hour, no. You're selling hours of your life away for 15 bucks a piece. So what do I say to the person who wants to get paid what they deserve? Be your own boss. That's right, be your own boss. Now, life, am I right? Life is full of adversity and challenges. But if you want to learn from your mistakes instead of getting punished for someone else's, what are you going to do? Be your own boss. Be your own boss. Be your own boss. You've been an amazing audience. T-shirts, DVDs, and signed photos are available for purchase in the lobby. Thank you, Stillwater, and good night. Oh, Stillwater, huh? That was a cool little reference right there. I didn't know Stillwater, like, I thought, uh, Lost, whatever, uh, Saints Row, this reboot took place. I thought that replaces Stillwater. That's interesting. I wish we could call it backup like Gwen. Is this car? Don't worry, guys. I'm coming. Just 
to dress a little proper. There we go. I'm back in my proper attire. You gonna come out and face me? Or do I gotta come to you like last time? See you soon. All right, here's the deal. You motherfuckers know where your boss is keeping my friends. So how about you just tell me, and then I can be on my way. Any takers? I know it's not likely, but you know, I figure I should do due diligence. It's really in your best interest, I... I only need one of you live to tell me what I need to know, and the odds of it being you is pretty... You know what? Fuck it. I tried. This one's asking for it! You gonna tell me what I wanna know? I'll never leave this place alive! I mean, she's right. We did try. Yeah. Listening! Oh. Will die no surprise himself. there. If somebody talks, move closer. Uh, you have walked into the now. Crap. Sorry, I need the help. Tell me where my friends are. Uh, I always had it. Uh, uh, oh. Who's next? Got you. Got you. Do some reloading action with nothing. You will die in silver coach. You mean stagecoach? The Wally! Get out here and face me yourself! They had no chance. Not live long enough to find your friends. Test me and find out. Just wow. tell me where my friends are. This gun's a lot better than it needs to upgrade it. They can't take me down. You're not gonna stop me. Maybe slow me down, but not stop me. He throw a grenade at himself. Uh oh. This definitely screamed firefight. Not 
matrix recognized. Welcome, employee 92245. Huh. Guess this old Marshall stuff still has me in the database. Bet I can make him talk now. Smaller than I remembered. Hey! Offer's still open! Tell me where the Nawali is and I won't kill you! All the rest of you are fair game! And Taker? How about you? Uh. Come on, someone needs to come over here. Nobody's gonna talk? Seriously? It's actually probably in my best interest if I just let them come up here. Come on, guys! This is just wasteful! Are they coming? Oh, they're waiting for me? I'm low on ammo. Lab. Oh. I didn't think I'd have to kill more than like ten of you, but whatever. Oh. That was way too stinky close. Special. Well, I can't pick it up. Kill them all again. Oh, good. There's more. Holy shit, there's more. It is 1000% okay. All right, let's do this. Secret dies with you? Okay, that's what you want. Gonna get anyone? Believe this hunk of junk is still here. You want some love too? Ah. Uh. <gasps> ah. Dude, I've had a long fucking day. Can we? Can we please be reasonable people? I can't. You're gonna say you can't tell me because the Nawali will kill you, then I'll say, if you don't tell me, I'll kill you, and we're just gonna be right back to where we started, so let's just skip that part. No, I was gonna say I can put the address in your phone. Oh. Uh, yeah. No. <clears throat> That'd be super helpful. You mind unlocking it? Whoops. Sorry about that. Uh... You're a fucking maniac. Well, you know, I have a lot of practice and pent-up rage. I hear that. Parents? Alimony. Ah. Anyway, secret bunker address is in there. Thanks, man. I'm George, by the way. You're an all right guy, George. When you wake up, you should stop by the church. The saints could use a guy with some common sense. Oh! Now, let's see if my biometrics still work on this VTOL. I knew. I wish when the subtitle uh, came up, when uh, George started talking, it said George instead of uh, what's his face is grunt. All right, cool. All right, we are off.
Really a laser? Jesus Christ, Marshall. How the heck did these guys beat them in freaking Saints Row 3? Well, whoever, what was that military presence in Saints Row 3? I totally forgot. Weren't their name Marshalls or something like that too? close. There you are. Still got it. Ah. Rocket launchers. Cute. Okay, I missed every single shot, but I made them hurt. I, I made them fear me. Yeah, and I would know because I was kind of there. Got a fucking VTOL, dumbass. You can't even slow me down. Okay. What do we got here? Nice one. Never seen a Vito shoot a laser before. Seems pretty cool. And Vamos. Last but certainly not least. Oh, did I miss him? Oh, I keep... Okay, there we go. And done. Now for the inside. Make way, make way. Let's do this. How long are we gonna play house for this nut job? Hey, look, as long as he's happy, we're not dead. We just need to figure out a way to escape. Maybe I could poison his food? He makes you eat whatever you cook for him. I can take one for the team. Don't be crazy. What if we trade? Holy shit, are we mic'd? No. This is something else. I want them secured. What's going on? It's for your own safety. It's our roommate, isn't it? They're here to say... <clears throat> save you? Is that what you... Eli, I'm sorry I hit you. There's a lot going on right now, and I got upset. Everything's going to be fine. Don't worry, guys. I'm coming. I don't know Nina, where I got that Ted, pistol from. Eli? You need not worry over their safety. They are with me now. Alas, you will not survive long enough to see this for yourself. I'm coming to end you, asshole! Just gotta do this first. Nice one. Oh! Watch me. Uh. Uh. But you've already 
lost. What the? They had no chance. Surrender! We've got you outnumbered. Oh! I'll go around them. <laughs> Where are they? One step at a time. Oh. Oh. There we go. Finally, I got you. Like, look, I was going to hit him sooner or later. You're not the only one that can throw a grenade. But that one actually hits you. Won't let you stop me. No chance. Do not worry, my friends. Things are going back to the way they were. You guys okay? We're fine. Why is Kev wearing a shirt? Oh, it's a lot. Look out! <laughs> Don't you see? You were never meant to protect them. You don't get it. They don't need my help. I need theirs. Now, buddy. Everyone okay? We are good now. I'll be better when I get this stupid shirt off. Look before you shoot, man. Yeah. Why? What's a moving? Is RPG him <laughs> until the game is like, nope, you're taking down way too much of his help. Let's take it back. Of the Reaper. Holy boy, goody.
here, you coward. Max Payne, this. Small fries. You go kill the shit out of that asshole. You got this. Right. I got this. Oh, I can't help my leg. I just want to give you guys some type of cover. I can't help it. Be safe. Did I just drop? For this bitch slap, bitch slap, man punch. I know there's like one more person around. Hello. Alright, see ya, asshole.
Oh man, this is like Red Dead Redemption. I've always been bad at these. You guys should come up here. It's a hell of a view. Mortal terror aside, today was a good day. Yes, sir, it was. I'm really sorry, guys. About what? You saved our ass. It was also my idea to get the Nawali's help in the first place. No one could have predicted that much crazy. Bad hires happen. It's okay. No. If anything happened to you guys, I... Hey, we love you. I love you guys, too. That's because we're fucking awesome. Here, here. You know, the Saints have only been around for like a minute, and we've already gained and defeated a nemesis. Not a bad start. No. Not bad at all. And that, ladies and gents, was Saints Row. Thank you all for watching this, and thank you all for joining me for this walkthrough. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Much appreciated. And before I continue with my TLDR review of this game, ladies and gents, full disclosure, I did receive this free and early copy of Saints Row from Deep Silver themselves, so please take my opinion of this game with a grain of salt. And with all that being said and out of the way, ladies and gents, overall, I would say I'm actually quite disappointed with the new Saints Row game. And that's for a multiple, that's multiple factors from writing, characters, gameplay, and the technical problems that could be that could be because I'm on the original Xbox One uh, playing this on the original Xbox One but I've seen over the interwebs and my peers like they've also ran into a lot of game breaking stuff and technical issues playing on PCs and next gen consoles but anyways um, let's start with the writing and the story and the characters and whatnot I'm really disappointed with that the, the most because I love the characters you know Saints Row doesn't have like the best writing but the characters and like Saints Row three and four even two to a degree were like really fun and enjoyable and cool to hang around with but the main cast of the new saints row game they're kind of like a little boring and, and iffy they're like eh whatever like i feel like the best and close written character in the new saints row game is eli like he is he's the nerd and whatnot who who's into you know nerdy cool you know nerdy cool like high fantasy type culture and whatnot like he's into like warping and his loyalty missions i mean loyalty missions are like like the like a big problem with with that but like his loyalty mission is where is you he takes his boss you out for a larp and you have to do some larpy missions and you know take over a base and this is a huge you know larp fight and all that stuff it is really cool and it, it kind of adds a little bit to his personality and character but after that when you get to the other cast like they're really kind of like one note personality character wise and you don't really get that much depth with them perfect example is is nia it's like okay she likes cars and she's a gearhead that's about it and at the end of her loyalty mission or her last loyalty mission you steal art for her because she likes art that that that's literally it that's about that's legit like all you get from her kevin he likes to cook with his shirt off or he likes to take his shirt off he doesn't wear a shirt he likes to cook with that one that's about it oh yeah and he, 
say he's ripped he likes to work out sometimes and then there's and there's and then there's a cat named snickerdoodle that's literally it out of uh, what you get out of the new characters like you don't you have like it could be because this is the first who knows if they're gonna make another second reboot uh, century game okay? but it could be because this is the first you know you know game in the series reboot series of century game okay? but like like it sucks that we don't have like characterization you know depth character in depth characters like you know shawnee from saints row 3 and 4 even 2 or keep david playing himself in saints row 3 and 4 which is freaking awesome and funny or johnny freaking get the man myth and legend in the in the older saints row games not reboot saints row games like none of the characters have that and other than eli's like the loyalty missions for nia and and kev are very boring and they don't add anything to their characters and that's another thing with the missions like the first few hours of saints row ladies and gents pretty freaking great like i thought they were pretty good and well done i'm like oh this is saints row how i know and love well, what i know and remember from older saints row games and, and love but after that after you get your saints row you know headquarters and i think the mission after that it's like it becomes like miscellaneous felt like feels like miscellaneous quest fetch quest that really don't matter it's like the first few hours of the game matter it helps build your empire and your name brand of saints of of the saints and then it's like the last few missions and a little and like one or two missions in the middle but it's like those it's the, it's like that five extra five or six hours in the middle of the game that really don't matter and the missions really don't matter and add anything to to your you know your squad of saints or you know personalities to you you your boss or your the characters around you and which is very 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 disappointing in my personal opinion the gameplay i would say uh it's very wonky and generic like it's a mixture between Saints Row 2 and 3 I would say leaning more towards 2 than 3 which in my personal opinion at first I would say oh man you're mixing between the, like the new Saints Row game is going to be a mix between Saints Row 2 and 3 like 2 Saints Row game people really love the groundiness and the seriousness of Saints Row 2 and the over the top walkiness of Saints Row 3 but like it, it just clashes like the gameplay clashes like it wants to be that fluidity kind of like high speed you know high impact action crazy bad shit crazy you know freaking anal probe and dildo backs gameplay like saints row 3 and 4 but it's mostly in line with saints row 2 it's kind of slow and, and whatnot it doesn't have the same fluidity and with some of the technical issues it's it, it becomes really wonky and honestly like game breaking which is disappointing because i've ran into a few game breaking bugs where like there are enemies that don't spawn near me so i can kill them to move on to the next objective like they they spawn like outside the mission um area and i can't get to them if i go outside that mission area i lose you know, i had to start the mission over or start start from the previous checkpoint which is very disappointing and that's why i it feels like with kind of like you know the story that they're kind of going for with saints row the reboot like they kind of tried to have that mixture between saints row 2 the 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 seriousness uh of saints row 2 and the over-the-top wonkiness of saints row 3 and 4 and at first i was like that's a pretty good idea hopefully this works works but like it feels like it doesn't work that well like maybe they should have like made kind of like a saints row three another saints row three instead of like a hybrid of saints row two and three because maybe because the seriousness and, and the groundedness of saints row two and the over-the-top wonkiness of saints row three and four I, I personally don't think it mixes that well like there are some games that do like do the old generation new generation mixes kind of well uh i.e halo infinite mixes you know the classic old bungee era of game play and the new 343 um advanced movement gameplay pretty well in my personal opinion but yeah quite the disappointment ladies and gents personally and of course i already talked about the technical issues uh man i i am quite disappointed because i was really looking forward to this game and then and of course you know the repetitive mission structure but again the first few hours of this game were actually really great and i thought the last few missions were really good with some sprinkles of like one or two missions in the middle of the game that were actually pretty good but the the loyalty missions were a disappointment that you're supposed to build the characters the main cast the personality you get to know them more but yeah it, it's just it's not all that well well written in my personal opinion um so yeah ladies and gents the new saints row game uh, a disappointment and an okay dis a very okay disappointment in my personal opinion uh so yeah for my next gameplay waffle ladies and gents i just want to touch on this for a quick second um my full my next full gameplay walkthrough will be destroy all humans 
Humans 2 Reproved uh, or Destroy the Humans 2 Remake. Uh, be expecting part one of that walkthrough to go live this Friday morning, I think, uh, or Friday afternoon. One of those two times. But this Friday, uh, that walkthrough will be two, uh, or excuse me, three parts long. And after that, it will be, I'll be doing a full gameplay walkthrough of, if I have the time, uh, Infamous 2. To round out my Infamous walkthroughs, I already did a walkthrough of Infamous month 1. Now we'll move over to Infamous 2. And after that will be Last of Us Part 1 Remake. I've actually never played Last of Us 1. I played Last of Us 2 and watched cutscenes and Let's Plays and walkthroughs of Last of Us 1, so I know the story and whatnot, but I've never actually got to play Last of Us uh, 1. So yeah, I cannot wait to uh, for, for the remake because it looks pretty stinking, uh, pretty stinking good. And yeah, uh, I think that's about it. Like I said, ladies and gents, thank you all for watching this and thank you all for joining me for this walkthrough. Thank you all for the love and support on this walkthrough and on my other walkthroughs and on my channel as a whole. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Much appreciate it. Before I let you guys all go, uh, all, all go, all go, if you guys can please leave a like on this video if you guys like what you saw, please subscribe for more content that helps about the channel a lot. When you do subscribe, make sure you hit that little bell. That's the notification bell next to the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any content I post on this channel. Uh, please sh share my channel and my videos to all your friends, families, cats, and dogs, and whoever who not. And you guys can all follow me on Twitter at Beta, B A Y T U H. If you want to keep supporting me even further than just subscribing to my YouTube channel, leaving a like, sharing my channel and my videos to all your friends and families, please consider donating some of your extra money you have lying around to my Patreon and or PayPal or the YouTube Super Thanks. That is patreon.com slash beta B A Y T U H and or paypal.me slash beta B A Y T U H and or through YouTube super, uh, super Thanks. That is uh all you need to do is click on any one of my videos that are monetized, which is 99.9% .9 of them, and hit that little money heart thanks button and donate however much you want. Any and all donations, ladies and gents, are much appreciated and it's 100 percent completely optional. And with all that being said, ladies and gents, without further ado, my name is Malcolm, also known as Beta, and I will catch you guys all on my next walkthrough, let's play, live stream, or whatever else I do next on this channel, which is very, very, very soon. Peace, thank you all for watching, and I love you all.